Good morning, Queen Anne's County High School. I'm your boy, William Hussey, joined today by Jeremy Hover and Nathan Taylor. Today is Thursday, September 16th, and let's get it started with an announcement from the guidance department. Juniors and seniors, please make sure you sign up on Naviance because there is a college visit from Bryant University from Rhode Island tomorrow in the guidance office at 1.30. Shout out to Elizabeth Oldfield for winning the powder puff game for the juniors with the overtime field goal competition, beating out the sophomores 12 to nine. Over to you, Lizzie, with the lunch report. Hey guys, today's lunch is gonna be corn dogs. Our other options include hamburgers, cheeseburgers, chicken patties, salads, subs, and don't forget about your assorted fruits, vegetables, and low-fat milk on the side. Over to you, Nathan. Thank you, Lizzie. An announcement from the Engineering Club. Raffle tickets are available to purchase to win a custom green and gold guitar. 100% of proceeds go to benefit the Engineering Design and Development course to help fund more fun capstone projects, such as designing and building your own electric guitar. The cost of tickets are $5 for one, $10 for three, and $20 for seven. See Mr. Herman in room 318 or send an email to any engineering club student and they can help you get tickets. Now over to Ryan with the weather. Thank you, Nathan. Hello, guys. Today's weather is going to be really nice with a high of 79 and a low of 60 degrees. Now back to the desk with more news. If you're a freshman and you'd like to receive a class shirt, please email Ms. Coppedge. Class shirts will be $15 and they're a great way to show your school spirit for tomorrow. And other news, Interact Club will have an organizational meeting on Tuesday, September 20th at 2.30 p.m. All existing or new members should attend the meeting for more information. It'll be about 30 minutes long, and it'll go over how Interact can help you get service learning hours. Back to Cameron with sports. Anne's County, I have a special announcement today from the cross country team. Congratulations for a strong race yesterday against Ken Island, North Carolina, and Easton. In the field of 30 runners, Lady Lion Aaron Heiner came in ninth, and RJ Enzer came in 11th. For the men, they placed 55. Dylan Herlock came in a strong fifth place. Tanner Lyon came in eighth place. And freshman Cole Coppage placed 13th place. Great race, people. Also, if anyone's interested in playing the most awesome game of ice hockey, please see Miss Woodward in the gym for more information. We will take the ice the first week of October. Back to the desk. Thank you, Cameron. An announcement from the SGA. Homecoming dance tickets are still on sale. Today is the last day to catch them. They'll be right outside the cafeteria as usual. Still $20 for one ticket, $30 for a couple, and still on the topic of homecoming. If you want to get your car in the parade, just uh, contact Com or just visit him in room 306 before Friday. Now back to Lizzie. The first meeting of the Dungeons and Dragons Club will be on Friday, September 23rd. It will be immediately after school in Mr. Joffrey's room at 5 o'clock or until five o'clock. All students attending must ride the late bus home and ar or arrange for a ride to pick them up at five o'clock. Mr. Joffrey will have late bus passes. Anyone interested in playing is welcome. If you've played before, bring your knowledge and experience. And if you've never played but are curious, we'll walk you through the process of creating your new favorite fictional character. So come to the first meeting of the Dungeons and Dragons Club on Friday, September the 23rd in Mr. Joffrey's room. Back to the desk. All right, don't forget, guys, that tomorrow is Green and Gold Day, and it's also the pep rally. So don't only bring your green and gold, bring your spirit. This has been the morning announcements. I've been William Hussey. This has been Nathan Taylor, and this has been Jeremy Hover. We will see you all tomorrow.